Hey up me ducks, it's Simon here. Welcome back to the Hermit's Cave. <sighs> it's Friday. And we made it. And the only reason I'm saying that is just because I've spoken to quite a few people this week. And this week, I don't know why, but it has just been so incredibly busy and stressful. Positive stressful, I might add. I do believe that there's positive stress as well as negative stress that goes into anxiety. But, you know, when you just feel like so much is happening and I was able to block out the week and plan what I'm doing, but there literally hasn't been much of a spare moment at all. But I'm on top of everything work-wise. I'm on top of all my readings that people have booked. Um... I've had my night class. I've done everything that I needed to do. Um, lots of travelling up and down the motorway this week. And I've been looking forward to this moment all week where I can get home, I can light all my candles, light some incense and just breathe out. And I love that feeling. And I feel very blessed to have the life that I have. Um, but I'm also... A hermit <laughs> and I like this time too to have a nice cuppa and just be at home around my things and just um, breathe out so for those of you who also and I've spoken to a few of you I've had a very busy stressful week you made it it's Friday it's the weekend enjoy and I've got a nice weekend planned. I'm chatting to Prent from Little Bear Tarot tomorrow as part of Catching Up With series. I've got some uh, walkthroughs of decks and things that I've bought. I'm expecting a trade coming tomorrow, which is three decks. But I'm coming to you tonight just to do um, a couple of unboxings of gifts that have been sent, which is really lovely. And the first one, I've had it for a couple of days and I, I have opened the box, but I haven't opened any of the packages inside. The reason why I opened the box is, this is from a lovely lady called Julia, who has sent a gift and she also said, would I pass something on to Becca? Which um, I've taken Becca's package out. Um, so I just wanted to do that ahead of doing um, the unboxing. So I'm just going to take out everything that I think is in here for me. It's beautifully packed. Um, Becca's came in a separate kind of bubble wrap with a card in it that said Becca. So just check everything's out there. So thank you, Julia. It was really kind. So yeah, um, firstly she put in, which I think is going to be so handy, this um, birdie box cutter. And it says never rust ceramic blade. So that's really useful, but it's perfect for opening boxes and great because I open a, a lot of boxes. So I'm going to pop this open. Um, and what a great little idea that is. So a ceramic, look at the ceramic blade look. It's the chain. So thank you for that. And we've got some honey, lemon, ginseng, green tea. A blend of green tea, honey, lemon, verbena, ginseng and herbs. 20 bags. Wow. They smell nice, so thank you. It's a nice little uh, box that kind of opens at the bottom so we've got some tea i've got something here that says paddy wax library um tangerine juniper and clove oh, i love anything clove clove is like the smell of christmas as well but it's in this long tin oh wow look at that it's a candle with two wicks oh i wish you could smell this Oh, that is beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. I love this little tin as well. I'm 
sure I'll be able to use that for something afterwards. It's like this, I bought this yesterday. It's a black pumpkin. It comes with a ceramic lid, goes on the top, and it's got pumpkin and ginger, I think, pumpkin and ginger, scented candle on the inside. But it's lovely, but it will make a nice little storage jar afterwards, a pumpkin storage jar. Or I can get one of those large, you know, the large 12 hour tea lights to go inside and still have it as a candle. But yeah, and that was eight pound from Next. And it's really, really nice. So I love nice smells. Here I've got something in a little bag. Oh. Jade Citrus Mint Flavoured Green Tea Blend. Citrus Mint. Wow, look at this bag. That's cool. Oh, wow. That's a really unusual smell, but it reminds me of something from my childhood. I can't think what it is. There is that mint in there. Maybe it's Pacers. Could be stiffened. <laughs> oh, that's beautiful. I've got to have one of them afterwards. There is a really familiar smell with that. Jade citrus mint flavoured green tea with spearmint and lemongrass. Oh, that's lovely. I'll pop that inside so keep the freshness in and I, I know what the contents is. Love this little bag. And then there's a little package here. Julia, this is so sweet of you. So there's a little card that says Simon the Hermit's Cave. And it's a Halloween card, look at that. Have an enchanted night. Thank you for all that you do for Tarot and for the Cavers. Keep the videos coming. <laughs> I will, Julia, I promise. Sending glowing good wishes for a bright and happy Halloween. She's put underneath Samhain. Regards, Julia. Oh, that is really, really lovely. I love that card. I have never seen a Halloween card in our card shops. I don't even know if we sell Halloween cards over here unless you buy them online. But I'm taking my birthday cards down after tonight. I like to keep them up for the week. Uh, but I'll be taking them down and I'll put them up. And there's some little uh, stickers and things here. Uh, artist trading card. This is Captain Halloween. And the artist is Julia Mitchell. And it's from the 8th of the 19th. No, you'd, America's different. 19th of the 8th. So 19th of August, 2015. And it's three of three. So there must be three stickers in there. And then there's this one. I love that. And on the back, she's put, I won't put a, put a full name on. October 2019. And she's put, A up, me ducks. <laughs> love it. That is so sweet. What we got here? Oh. Wow, look at this. This can be used for crafting and things. Oh, little ghosts, Lord. These are little, uh, like little Caspers. They're cool. Fillable tea bag for loose tea. Fillable tea bag. Not sure what a fillable tea bag is. Let's have a look. Fillable tea bag for loose tea. No way! I get it. So you get these tea bags, all separate tea bags, look, to put your loose tea in, and then you seal them up. What a great idea! A little tea bag. Love it! Never seen that before. Fillable tea bags for loose tea. Wow. Oh. 
I love how she's wrapped everything. Look at this, it's so Halloween-ish with the orange and the black. Julia, this is so, so sweet. There we go. Oh, wow. It's a, a little candle snuffer, which is perfect for my uh, space because my other candle snuffer that I have has gone into the bedroom where my, I've set, reset up, re-enshrined my gohonzon in the bedroom, which I, I haven't had out for a couple of years, and I've re-enshrined it, and I took the candle snuffer through there, and I did need one for in here, and this is just perfect. That's lovely. I really like that. So thank you. And there's still a couple more things. There's something here in a black pouch. Oh, there's a little tag inside. Oh, there's a couple of things. Kabamba Projects. Relaxes and soothes the heart chakra. Kabamba Projects. Oh, these are little crystals so we have oh a little heart which is this is gabbro it looked like um like obsidian that's like, almost like snowflake obsidian but it's called gabbro wow and then there's something here it says fragile on it oh that's beautiful Oh, wow. Look at that. That is gorgeous. Is this Gabbro as well? Or um, is this what you're calling the Kabamba? This must be Kabamba. Protects, relaxes and soothes. Well, I need that, especially tonight. So I'm gonna sit holding that tonight, but it is stunning. Absolutely beautiful. Julia, thank you. And then the last thing here, Daughters of the American Revolution, Transylvania chapter. As she said, it says, Simon, a gift from Kentucky, Julia. goodness oh my goodness look at this it's malachite on leather wow oh Julia this is beautiful malachite stone of Transformation and positive changes. One of a kind. Malachite on leather. <sighs> Look at that. And that is one of a kind. And that is gorgeous. I've always wanted to be able to have a Malachite uh, piece. So. Let me pop it on. Wow. Oh, I love it. Julia, thank you so, so much. I am absolutely blown away. This is so generous of you. And also, you know, I won't say here, but we've had conversations and your generosity with the things that you've done to make sure that I get this um, has just been wonderful. So thank you. Thank you so, so very much. There's still two other things that um, I want to show. Um, one is a package, I have no idea what it is. It says that it's come from Gloucester. 
but I don't think I've ordered anything from Gloucester. It feels quite heavy. It might not even be tarot related, uh, but I've also had a package from Sean. And talk about the universe and paying forward and stuff like that. Sean actually won my giveaway on uh, Saturday. I'm using my little box opener, which was for the, um, oh, I've gone completely blank. The Marigold Tarot. <laughs> uh, yeah, for the Marigold Tarot, um, which I'm mailing out tomorrow. I said I'd mail it out at the weekend. Um, and, you know, he's said, well, I've sent you something as well as a gift. So, um, you know, not even knowing about the... Uh, the giveaway which was pretty amazing really but you know that's how the universe operates um i'm struggling to get in it it's wrapped so well there we go and for some reason thankfully this this didn't get picked up by customs which is amazing because, um, yeah, most things are being picked up by customs now. So, um, he's put Simon, happy birthday, blessings from Sean. Thank you, Sean. Oh my goodness. He sent me the way home tarot. Oh, wow. Wow. Let's have a look. Oh. I've just taken the, the wrapper off. Oh wow, I've seen this and it, it is beautiful. So it comes in this nice sturdy two part box. I'll probably do a, a walkthrough of this, um, but it is gorgeous. I'll just show you a few of the a few of the cards. Here's the fool and the magician. Oh, look how beautiful that is! The high priestess. I love the empress and the emperor. Beautiful. The Hierophant. Lovers. It's, oh, look at Justice. The black and the white, that balance. Oh, and I love the Hermit. This was on my wish list. I've got a wish list uh, in my Midori where I write down indie decks and mass market decks. And the Way Home Tarot was on this list. I love this Hermit card, just look at that. How amazing. Oh. Strength is number 11 rather than eight. Hanged man. It is beautiful. Death is, is quite hard, but you know what? And these are the backs by the way. That's kind of that transition, isn't it? You know, nature. Um, I mean, this reminds me that the animal has passed away, other animals are feeding off that. They put that part of the animal becomes part of other animals. It's cyclical. Yes, it's not a, a pleasant image, but look at the devil. That's incredible. The tower. What a gorgeous deck. The moon. Wow. And look at the universe. Look at that card. Oh, Sean, thank you. I'm not going to show them all because I do want to do a walkthrough of this deck. 
it is stunning and the cards feel lovely they're silky and wow thank you so much so so much the way home tarot oh that's such a lovely birthday present thank you sean let's find out then what this is watch it be nothing to this will get edited out if it's nothing to do with uh tarot or my channel <laughs> probably something like hoover bags that works really nicely gone all the way down look Oh, this has arrived quickly. I only ordered this a couple of days ago. It's the Archetypes deck. Wow. It's come from Book Depository, because they put their little bookmark in. Um, it's not even available yet on Amazon, but I saw that it was on... See, Amazon do that thing where they... Um, they you can pre-order... But then the date comes round and they never seem to have it in. So book depository don't. They usually always fulfill or sometimes they send it ahead. This is such a heavy deck. Um, so this is the Wild Unknown Archetypes Deck and Guidebook by Kim Kranz. Um, again, over the weekend, I'll do a full unboxing and walkthrough of this. That's why it felt so heavy. It looks beautiful. It was very Kim Cran's art, as it would do. Wow, so I just wanted to come on and just sit and have a little bit of a chat at the end of a very busy week. Thank you so much to both Julia and Sean for your very, very kind gifts. As I said, I've got a trade coming tomorrow. I know it's coming tomorrow because it's coming by parcel force and I've requested that it comes tomorrow. For me to be in to accept it and there's three decks there so i've still got the um oswald worth archetypes the way home and the three decks tomorrow it's going to keep me busy i'm not going to order any more decks for the foreseeable um, but i will do walkthroughs over the next week or two thank you guys have a fantastic end of your week and i will see you all hopefully tomorrow for the interview with prent from little bear tarot until then, go in peace, namaste and blessed be.